How is it made? Ice cream! By R.J. Bailey. Chapter 1. A Cold Creamy Treat. What is your favorite summer treat? Is it cold? Is it creamy? It must be ice cream! People all over the world enjoy ice cream. Have you ever wondered how it is made? Let's tour an ice cream plant and find out. Chapter 2. At the Plant. Ice cream begins with milk. Workers load milk from dairy farms onto refrigerated trucks. The trucks bring it to the ice cream plant. At the plant, the milk is pumped into large tanks. The tanks are kept at 36 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 2 degrees Celsius. The milk goes into blenders. Workers add sugar and other ingredients such as eggs, salt, and stabilizers. Did you know? Ice cream must contain at least 10% fat. If there is less than that, the ice cream will not be smooth. It will taste icy. Once blended, the mix goes into a pasteurizer. This machine runs the cold mix through a series of heated pipes. The process kills bacteria that may be in the mix. Did you know? In 1864, French scientist Louis Pasteur found that heat could kill bacteria. The process he invented is called pasteurization. It makes milk and other foods safe to eat. Look! The mix goes into a homogenizer. The mix enters a tube. It is forced out with high pressure. The pressure makes the ice cream smoother. Take a look! The homogenizer uses pressure to make ice cream smoother. The, first, the ice cream mix is fed into the machine. Second, the milk fat is squished. Third, the smoother mixture is pushed out. The mix goes to a tank room. It rests for eight, four to eight hours. This cools the mix. At this stage, workers add flavors and colors. Did you know? Some people get brain freeze when they eat ice cream. The cold makes blood vessels in the head cool and shrink. The headache comes when they warm up again. The blood vessels swell, sending pain signals to the brain. After resting, the mix goes to the freezer. Air is pumped into the mix. This increases the ice cream's volume. When the mix leaves the freezer, it is still soft. A machine called a feeder adds items such as fruit, candy, and nuts. A blender mixes these large pieces into the soft ice cream. Did you know? Cones became popular in 1904. An ice cream seller at the St. Louis World's Fair ran out of dishes. A waffle maker wanted to help. He rolled his waffles into cones. Chapter 3. Final Steps A filling machine fills cartons with ice cream. It puts lids on them. It pushes the cartons onto a conveyor belt. An expiration date is printed onto each one. The belt moves the ice cream into a hardening room. The room is set at about minus 20 degrees Fahrenheit, or minus 29 degrees Celsius. The ice cream freezes. The frozen ice cream goes to cold warehouses. Workers load trucks. They bring the ice cream to stores. It is ready to eat. Who wants an ice cream cone? Take a look. How does milk become ice cream? Blending, heating, smoothing, resting, freezing, filling. And here we have activities and tools, which you can see when you buy the book. Glossary, bacteria, tiny life forms that can be dangerous if eaten. Conveyor belt, moving, a moving band of rubber or metal used for moving objects from one place to another. Expiration date, the date after which manufacturers recommend a food not to be eaten. Homogenizer, a machine that makes the balls of milk, fat, and ice cream smaller, thereby making the ice cream smooth. Ingredients, the things that are added into a mix to make ice cream and other foods. Pasteurizer, a machine that heats milk and other liquids to kill bacteria. Stabilizers, substances that slow the growth of ice crystals in ice cream. Volume, an amount of something. That was How Is It Made? 
Ice Cream by R.J. Bailey. And this is EDU Kids Space. Subscribe for more books, stories, and lessons. And if there's something in particular you'd like to learn about, leave us a message in the comments.